All right, this is Glozell, and this is my friend Leslie. Hello. Isn't she gorgeous? Okay, we watched Abraham, introducing Abraham, the secret behind the secret. And uh, Leslie here is a counselor, a therapist. Mm -hmm. And I don't know what else you want to say about yourself before. Well, you know, I think that that's the primary thing we can bring forward. And I'm also really interested in the Abraham teachings. And I thought we'd do a little exercise here and uh, see if we can help our wonderful, beautiful Glazelle to get what she wants in life. Okay, let's see. All right, go ahead. Okay, so, so tell me, what is it that you're uh, wanting to achieve? What do you want to have happen in your life? Well, I want money okay. and I don't feel bad about saying that I, I, mm -hmm. I want money because mm -hmm. I want my own house with SK okay. um, nice a nice place okay. and not have to worry about anything financially and get rid of debt as far as student loans that's the only debt I really have student okay. loans so from my understanding like with what we're learning with the Abraham materials part of thinking about or getting what we want is to really visualize what we want and, and to kind of get a sense, uh, almost a kinesthetic sense of what we want. So I'm wondering for you, what would it feel like to have money? What would be, what would that be like? What would your, be happening? I feel free, can travel, don't have to uh, look at labels. Mm -hmm. um, I'm cool with being around people who have money. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I just would like to be able to pay my own way. Mm -hmm or pay for them also because mm -hmm. people have been very very generous to me and um, and people in my circle so to speak um, what would that mean? Ha I feel happiness mm -hmm. for money is not the root of all evil I feel like the lack of money is that, mm -hmm. um, so yeah money. So what, what are some thoughts that you could maybe be thinking that might get you tuned in to the experience, the vibration of having money. Like, if you had money, I mean, what what were some, what are some thoughts you think you could be thinking? That are kind of let's tweak those. Like, I don't know. What do you mean? Like shopping? Well, or? something like it feels good to have money. See? So just yeah, it feels good to have money. It feels yeah. independent, knowing that if you know something happened with the car, I could just take mm -hmm. it in. I feel good mm -hmm. that uh, SK wouldn't have to be a. Uh, a bagger but mm -hmm, mm -hmm. a part of me feel like this experience mm -hmm. helps me know that he's willing to do what it takes mm -hmm. you know I just don't I, want him to I mean I think okay good examples yeah, over now yeah, you yeah. now we can be rich and go on yeah so you feel in a way it's nice that it's shown that he's really willing to put himself out there for me th th yeah, yeah for, you, for us for you, know, you right? yeah and that he's got some you know some yeah some gonads, yeah, yeah some balls but because if it, it hadn't happened then you know I I, yeah. I wouldn't have known yeah it was like oh, okay we just chill on his his pension but his pension's being mm -hmm. you know cut in half mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. he's willing to do that not just mm -hmm. be lazy so I think that's a neat point that it's kind of it, it, the experience maybe is you're going to move towards something different but it's broadened your awareness and your appreciation yes yeah yes. So I hear you say it feels good to have money, and you mm -hmm. kind of got excited when you were talking. Oh, we need to have this. I mean, what are some other thoughts like money? What, what would be happening for you? What well, I can uh, give some away. It would feel good. That would feel away and help uh -huh. fix up my mom's car. I mean, not her car, but her house, uh -huh. and um, remodel it. Kind okay. Of thing. Okay. And. Um, what would it be like for you to to know like tell me what that would feel like if you were to feel like gosh I've really got some good money in my bank account there's checks in the mail what would tell me about that what would that feel like well I feel like it'll feel independent and yeah. joy and uh, freedom I don't know if I said that already but sometimes you look at things like oh I can't do that because oh I don't have enough money where I don't want that to be an issue at all mm-hmm so you're saying you would feel a sense of freedom and independence. Um, yeah, fun. You know, and I guess what I'm trying to get a sense of is I, 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 part of my understanding of what what brings about us being able to get what we want is to really become um, what Abraham would say as a vibrational match to it. Okay. So it's almost like wonder what what is going to happen to for if you're here now and you want to be over here, what would life be like over here? I mean, what, on a day to day. Basis. Oh, day-to-day -day -day basis. Get, get, make it juicy. Okay, well, yeah. I'll get up and I'll tell the chef what I want. Uh -huh. 
and then maybe take a swim and you can come over mm -hmm. and of course and uh, we'll travel, mm -hmm. go to okay. spa and all yes, the time. All the time. All the time. Go <laughs> all to the spa. The time. Uh, hair done. Um, uh, nice hair weaves. Uh, mm -hmm. Get my own hair done also, mm -hmm. and uh, travel with my my friends. I have mm -hmm. a circle, a, a little network mm -hmm. with a few branches, but it's basically is you, Paria, Mary Q, S K. Can you think of any experiences in your, if you're going to kind of catch a wave of wealth right now in your life, mm -hmm. like how would you catch the wave? What's wealthy right now in your life? What, you know, like you did get your hair done or something like that. You've, so you want to talk about the things that I would get done with this month? No, I'm actually thinking of the ways that you're actually already oh. in a place of wealth vibrationally. And Okay. So the, the, how I'm already in wealth yeah. is... Let's say the Emmys were just last night. I did get a chance to get a dress. Mm -hmm. Now, I, for me, it, it it didn't bother me that it wasn't four or five hundred dollars. I was glad to go. Did it feel good? Did you feel? I felt great being in there. The dress I, you and, couldn't tell yeah. me that I wasn't. So, so let me get this straight. You just went to the Emmys. Yes. So you just went to the Emmys. Yes, I did, and I was on the red carpet with my camera. And your friend won an Emmy. <laughs> she did. Okay. She did. So that's. And I knew it. Now see, yeah. I was very positive about yeah. that. Like, yeah. if I can yeah. get that positivity right. about, right. I mean, right. clear without a doubt, right. I knew there was no hangups about it. I knew that she deserved it. It was just easy to to manifest that. Easy, for over a year. But, you know, when I come to myself, I have to think, oh, you know, but my weight and my age and my this, and you have to work through that. But, okay. So that's what I'm going to give it up now. So, and that's very important to note that you're kind of holding yourself back from your own yeah. uh, prosperity. I'm like, when I get yeah. thin, then this ah. is what I, when I did this. So but that's where that's we're what trying I'm... to figure out where you're wealthy now. Like, you went to the Emmys, yes. your friend won an Emmy. Yes. But who said that's like the sign of wealthy people yes. hang out with people that win Emmys, and, yes, you know? That's right, that's right. So, you're, so see, that's part of it is getting, getting, finding out where you are right now. And okay. that's one, that's one thing I really encourage you to think about because you got excited. Right? Yes, I'm very, boy did yeah. I get excited. So feel that. Remember okay. what that feels like and know that when you're in that place, you're that much closer to, to bringing it into your awareness and your reality. All right. So, okay. So wealth, you want more money. So that's one way you're already wealthy. What's another way that you already have wealth in your life? Another way I already have wealth in my life i.e. going to the Emmys. Well, I, well, it's also because of the same person, but I get a, go, a chance to go to a lot of great restaurants and great places. Okay, so in some ways. I mean, so I yeah. do experience a life Okay. like no other. And even Bob and Steve, like Tuesday, yeah. we're, we're hanging out. Yeah. Steve is engaged. That's a whole other story. Okay. I can't believe that. But that also shows me anything can be done. Mm -hmm. Last year okay. he was on his deathbed. This year he's getting engaged. He's married, so. Mm -hmm. So why is it okay for you to have what you want, to create what you want? How can you now let that be okay for you to receive the benefits of your thoughts and your intentions? It's okay for me to receive money, wealth, and everything of my desires because that's what I was put here on earth for, to enjoy and not be, uh, be prosperous, how do you say it? prosperous and joyful and not deal only deal with the positive I was gonna go through the things that I not supposed to deal with but that would be negative so so okay that sounds pretty good but yeah. I'm just wondering about tell me why tell me why it's, it's okay I'm just I guess I'll, I'll tell you that it's okay for you to receive you're allowed to have a good life yes you don't have to suffer there's not something that's written that that you got to suffer and pay your dues and, right I mean absolutely you're able I'm to deserving. receive you absolutely yes. so can you tell me a can you find that place inside of you that does feel deserving and go speak with that I am deserving of a wonderful career a great man in my life I'm deserving of finances abundance over and beyond I'm uh, I deserve health and well-being and a great life and long prosperous life and be surrounded by positive happy people that are working on the same accord mm -hmm. and let me ask you 